published in Nature Astronomy Today, a team from New York University's Abu Dhabi Center for Space Science analyzed 25 years of space and ground-based observations of energy waves from our host star. They discovered a new set of waves moving in the opposite direction of the Sun's rotation, inexplicably traveling faster than was theoretically possible. These waves appear as a pattern of vortices, in a swirling motion, on the Sun's surface and move at three times the speed of other types of waves on the star. Known as high-frequency retrograde HFR, waves, they provide unprecedented insight into the inner workings of a star and could one day lead to new types of physics, as follow-up studies try to explain how they can be so fast. High-frequency waves swirling on the Sun have left scientists confused, as the unexpected bursts of energy are moving at speeds that defy explanation. The interior of the Sun, like other stars of its type, cannot be imaged by conventional astronomy, whether it be optical, X-ray, or infrared techniques. This means scientists have to rely on interpreting the surface signatures of various waves of light to understand what is happening deep inside. These new high-frequency retrograde waves, named because of their counter-direction, may yet be an essential puzzle piece in our understanding of stars. The study predicts that complex interactions between other well-known waves and magnetism, gravity, or convection could drive the HFR waves at an incredible speed. By studying the Sun's internal dynamics, through waves, scientists can better appreciate its potential impact on the Earth and other planets. It comes under a relatively niche area of astronomy, known as helioseismology, which relies on studying acoustic waves seen in the Sun. This is similar to the study of waves on Earth that can predict earthquakes. Studying these waves has been used with the Sun to understand more about its internal rotation and structure, which would be impossible using direct observation techniques. However, acoustic waves are insensitive to things like magnetic fields, entropy, and convection, which are critical to theories of solar dynamics. The new team used helioseismic and correlation tracking analyses of ground and space-based observations to look at other wave types within the star to bridge the gap. This refers to a new type of wave that swirls in the opposite direction to the Sun's rotation and moves three times faster than other wave types. The team explained that this can't be explained by standard hydrodynamic mechanisms, suggesting new physics might be at play in the rarefied, intense interior of stars like our Sun. They first assumed that the waves are being excited by Coriolis force and then modified by internal magnetic fields, gravity, and compressibility, which is how compressed it can be at any given time, based on the conditions in the area. The study says it has proved challenging to work out where HFR fits within the broader context of solar dynamics, as they are unlikely to belong to the features that commonly arise in standard theories. The Sun isn't the only place these types of waves have been spotted, as a study 30 years ago found as yet unexplained high-frequency waves in Earth's ocean. This phenomenon puzzles atmospheric scientists three decades on, despite a significant effort to explain them. Known as oceanic Rossby waves, they were found above tropical latitudes and were seen to exhibit high phase speeds, up to four times greater than expected in theory.